Field watches are typically simple, petite, and utilitarian, optimized for actual use as a tool in the field of battle. Ferrer is a micro brand that provides an interesting design take on all sorts of watch styles. And today we're going to take a look at one of the brand's field options. This is the Exmoor. I've been a fan of Ferrer for a long time, and I've owned a few different Ferrer references in the past and I've had my hands on even more. I think that Ferrer is in an elite class of high quality watch brands that not only deliver great watches, but also really good customer service, which I think is crucial to the success of a micro brand strategy. Ferrer offers free shipping worldwide, a five year movement guarantee, and offers free returns for a whole 30 days. The brand's collection offers a really great variety across numerous designs, complications, colors, materials, and other variations. Ferrer has designed a few field references during its eight year history, but today they only currently offer this Exmoor reference and the Le Monde, which are both available for under $1,000 USD. The dimensions on this 316 marine grade stainless steel case come in at 38.5 millimeters in diameter, about 12.3 millimeters in thickness, and spans the wrist at 45 millimeters lug to lug. This watch fits great on my 17 centimeter wrist. The case has a completely brushed satin finish with simple lines and shapes with a base case with integrated lugs and a beefy sloping bezel leading up to a flat sapphire crystal with anti-reflective coating. The signed screw down crown at the three o'clock includes Ferrer's classic signature insert in bronze. And with that, plus the solid case back, it delivers a great 200 meters of water resistance. The case back has an etched landscape picture of a mountain looming over a body of water and includes the text on land and water. The dial in this piece is a matte olive green color with a tight grainy texture. The outer rehot is a date track utilized by the pointer day function in white painted text with red signifying the last four days of the month. Just inside the rehot is a painted minute track with painted hour markers in white and yellow with large white painted Arabic numerals. There is the Ferrer logo at the 12 o'clock in automatic and water resistance rating at the 6. The hour and minute hands are stainless steel loom filled syringe shaped hands. The seconds hand is light blue with a red tip and a loom pip, and the pointer date hand is an orangish red color with the Ferrer logo cleverly added to the tip to highlight the date. The markers on the dial have superluminova, but for my test, these did not shine very brightly. The 26 joule movement is the Swiss Solita SW221-1 automatic movement, which beats at 28,800 vibrations per hour. The watch includes an Inkablock Nova Deatic shock absorber, and comes with hacking seconds and a quick set pointer date function. The moon has 38 hours of power reserve, which I wish was a little bit higher. This field watch amazingly comes with two included straps and one bracelet. The Exmoor comes out of the box on a tan American Horween leather strap with steel buckle, and the box also includes a blue waterproof nylon NATO strap and a five link Jubilee style stainless steel bracelet with butterfly clasp. All included straps include quick release mechanisms, and the watch has a 20 millimeter lug width. The three included straps is a spectacular highlight of this watch, and you have multiple strap options to equip this field reference to your wrist with the style you want. At under $1,000 USD, this is a great value for 200 meters water resistance, a pointer date function, and three different straps. A great option if you're looking for a fun, vibrant field watch that still stays true to the simplistic historic style of the field watch genre. As I mentioned, Ferra has fantastic customer service, so feel free to give this watch and other watches from the brand a try. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.